share with you what I made. Um, I made zucchini cheesy bread. Um, it's macro friendly. So if you're on prep, this is still good for you. There's no, um, there's no carbs, hardly any carbs. I personally cannot, I don't need to uh, track zucchini. So there's mozzarella in it. Uh, there's um, Parmesan cheese. There's no carbs in Parmesan cheese and mozzarella, which is a good thing. I love cheese. Um, zucchini, there's uh, Italian seasonings. There is pepper, ground pepper, I mean ground pepper, um, salt, all that good stuff. But basically, I took it out of the oven. Look at my cheesy bread. So I'm going to my stepson's little um, belated birthday and I made some something. I wanted to bring something that I could eat too and not just, you know, stare at everybody eating. So this is something really good for you to do if you're trying to go to a party. Bring something healthy where you can eat it and it's macro friendly. So, look. I mean, come on, guys. Look at that. I'm so excited to try this. Looks really, really good. Ah, oh, it's so perfect. Um, I found this recipe actually on Facebook. Um, if you want to know how I made this, um, I will make it this again. Um, just let me know in the comments down below. But this is something that I think was a really good, um, you know, alternative for people that are on a diet or on prep. Um, bring something really healthy that you can eat for yourself at that party and you won't feel excluded from the group and you won't look like a weirdo because for me in Hawaii our culture when we have uh, parties we go all out we bring any kind of food like trust me we know how to grind so I understand that um, it may you may want to eat but at our family parties if you don't eat it's a sign that it's kind of rude so um, I try to bring stuff so this is a way you can also make avocado dip you can eat that at the party and then bring your own food so it doesn't look like you're just you know you're disgusted with other people's food so yeah um i hope this helps you in your journey hello good afternoon it is monday august 28th and i just got home from work um i haven't vlogged much last week so i'm gonna try to vlog more this week but I thought I'd show you my post or pre-workout meal that I cooked up. I have some shrimp, I have some chicken, I have some broccoli. So this is my pre-workout meal and slash dinner. What are you doing, Missy? Missy Elliott, what are you doing? drives me nuts. He knew when he trusted you that you were going to need him. He knew it, but he's been waiting on you to know it. He gave you an assignment that was too big to do by yourself, that sooner or later you would humble yourself and say, God, I can't take it without you. I can't make it without you. I can't do it without you. It's August 30th, Wednesday. I'm so tired, but I'm going to go to the gym. I'm going to conquer this workout, and you going to come with me. Yes. Oh, yeah. It's upper body day. I have to do my hip before my upper body. I'm going to be doing um, on the Stairmaster for 30 minutes. And so, yeah, I'm actually kind of really excited because I'm really bloated, still bloated. Um... I cut out some things from my from my diet. I cut out whey protein um, just because I think that's making me bloated and my Shakeology. So I'm kind of sad, but I just want this bloating to get under control so I can figure out what the heck is making me bloat so I can figure that out first before I'm even competing and being on stage and I'm, I'm like a big balloon, you know what I mean? So I'm gonna go to the gym I'm going to sit in the sauna, and then I'm going to go do hit, then upper body. Yeah. I'll see you there.
enjoyed that workout it was so much fun I was tired but you know it was fun um, it was a good oh, arm day yeah. my arms are like noodles um, <laughs> try that well so this is just my journey I'm not a trainer I am NOT a nutritionist I just love fitness I research before I started with my coach I I researched every single routine I also was trained by my mom she worked out with bodybuilders trainers when she was younger like my age and she was actually gonna compete but you know kids happened but um so I just want to point out there I'm not you know in any shape or form a trainer I would love to be but I don't got the money or the time to just want to point that out because I do research all my moves all my workout routines and I ask people like at the gym that are trainers um, to help me 
now that I am in training, I do, I know all the stuff that she gave me, so it makes it her, makes her job a little bit easier because I already know how to do all the workouts. If I don't, I look online. <laughs> I look online by trainers. Um, so yeah, so I just wanna point that out there today. So, I'm gonna go home because I'm tired, but I'll talk to you guys later.